We are in the island of Greensay and one might think we're going to photograph puffins, but that's not our intention this time. We had been waiting for the right sunset conditions to go to Borgin. Borgin is a columnar basalt rock with hundreds of puffins on top. The biggest chocolate company in Iceland used our photos of this rock when designing new chocolate boxes. And in this video we visit the location again, trying to retake similar scenes. This is looking very good. Yep. The puffins look like kings up there. Yeah, I see. Can you see the green color? Yeah, it seems to be greener. More greener than yellow, like last time. Yeah. The sun makes the colors pop out. Looks nice. Yeah. We're gonna race against the time. The sun is still up, but there are clouds threatening to uh, shut it off. Everything's very slippery. We have to be very careful. Okay, I'm putting on a six stop filter. But from experience, I know that if I want to get rid of uh, endless streaks in the sky because of flying puffins. I need to expose you this uh, about 20 seconds and they probably won't bother me but uh, I'm not sure six stop will do but I'll see Oof. where am I gonna stand? the histogram says I can expose at 30 seconds at F16 Lowest ISO, and let's just close this. The viewfinder from behind, because I have a sun, it would probably destroy it. And let's I have a three second exposure delay. Isn't this beautiful? Does this look? Not bad. I would like to get the rock in the foreground, the green rock in the foreground. I would like to get it a little bit more to the right because the composition lacks something on, on the right side or there. So let's see what I can do. I think it's not going to work. And why? Because this is a big rock and uh, it's taking up too much space in the image. So uh, I want the rocks to be the center of at attention. And this is taking the attention away. It's not easy to stand here, it's super slippery. Mm. I'm not even going to take a photo because it's uh, it sucks. This is not working and I'm getting wet. This is not the best use for this. Well, it would have been better if we had uh, brought our boots. Yep. It's really popping out now. Now, one of the reasons we're here is uh, the, we are in Grimsey, North Iceland, and uh, the rock you see there is Borkin. It's a columnar basalt heaven with a lot of puffins on top, and uh, 
they say, of course, because it's a beautiful rock, that there are elves living in it, according to Icelandic folk tales. Ooh. Careful! <laughs> it's slippery. It's slippery. Oh. Oh. Whoa! See all the puffins go. Here I have a six stop filter and a polarizer. We have just a few minutes with the sun, I think. Wow, see how the colors are they're turning red. The conditions at Borgin depend not only on the light and the wind, but also on the tides. Low tide means you have more options when it comes to foregrounds. And these photos are older photos taken a few years ago when white sand was all over the beach. The sand seems to come and go, and uh, I think the sand adds a lot of overall feeling to the image, even though the rock is still the main subject. There are some guys on jet skis there, that's what you can hear in the background. They are messing up our mirror. The reflection is gone. I want to show you one of the reasons we're here. Gida shot this photo a few years ago. It's a uh, Borgin chocolate. Well, I can, I, th I think I can say that this is one of the most popular chocolates in Iceland, and uh, it's very tasty. So when you get here, find it. Oh, is it time for coffee? I think it's time for coffee now. Oof! And I'm maybe chocolate. <laughs> Don't fall, darling. Oh my god! <laughs> Oof, this is a beautiful box of chocolates and uh, I think you can see the scene, it's spectacular and uh, I don't know if, uh, if we are... Uh, Oops, watch out! Yep, if we are uh, repeating the scene, but uh, <laughs> at least it's wonderful to be here. But wow, well, this will just it's beautiful. Change. It's yellow, pink and blue. Oh, I have, to, I have to show them. Yeah. Turn the camera around. Turn the camera around. The puffin is flying everywhere now. It's not windy, but people are here close now, so... That's how it looks, more or less. I'm changing the aperture. Gida shot these photos when the colors were really at the best. The green color of the rock turns a bit yellow and bright, giving the scene a golden feeling. This might not be a famous landscape location, but it sure is nice to spend an evening there. Working is like a chocolate. It is uh, a little bit like a chocolate. Yeah. And, uh, well... We say it molly. In Iceland. Piece of chocolate. Piece of chocolate. It's very nice. You should try it if you come to Iceland because it's very good. Yeah. It's not the best no. location to stand on, but it's. Uh, this is where the motive is, so uh, this is where we are. Yes. Best chocolate in Iceland. <laughs> <laughs> And the best coffee. Yeah. Gida is from Grimsey, and we are in Grimsey now. Mm -hmm. Borgin in Grimsey. And. Uh, I saw plenty to photograph. Oh, there's always something. Mm -hmm. We come here year after year. Yeah. And uh, we're still finding something to do. And it's just a good place to relax and. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
have a good time. It's been a lovely evening of photography in Grimsey and uh, thank you for watching. We're very, very thankful for all our subscribers we've been getting. Oh yes. But remember if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe.